I wanted to show you here is um, in Drum Machine Designer, um, you get the ability to obviously trigger individual tracks here as well. So um, that's just my kick, which is pitched up and down across the keyboard, kind of like if you watch my sampling thing, you would see what I mean by that. It's kind of mapped out in that certain way. Um, so what I tend to do is, because this is already set out for me, I will go here and I will just copy down everything. So if you remember the three elements that I was using um, were the kick, the snare and the hi-hat. And basically on this top region here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to remove everything apart from my kick. So, so that is my kick information there. That's my kick pattern. I'm going to remove everything apart from my snare on this one. So, <laughs> sounds quite funny. Um, and here I'm going to remove everything apart from my hats. Um, now this seems like it's all pitched incorrectly. So make sure that you grab all of these and you pitch them on, I think it would be show up as C3 would be the actual um, key that you want all of these on. So no, C2. Um, and make sure this is on C2 as well. So I think that's right. Oh, that's quite nice actually. Um, I might leave that there. Um, and my hats as well. So hats, the original key was that, I think. Um, although, I'll leave them there. So here's how that now sounds with them. I have independent control over, you know, what information is on them. Like I can change the EQ on all of them individually. Um, or I can just go back to Drum Machine Designer and they'll still all be triggering in the same way. Oh yeah, that bass doesn't work over that second part. Um, so hopefully uh, that's been helpful. If you um, if you would like more information about any of our courses, I don't know what I did there. Um, if you'd like any more information about any of our courses, please go to www.garnishmusicproduction.com. Um, we have schools in London, which is obviously where I'm from. Um, we have schools in LA, New York, um, and various different locations around the world. Um, we've got short courses, we've got long courses, and uh, obviously things like this is covered in those courses and many more. Um, but until our next stream from London, thank you guys for watching. Um, I hope you learned something and I hope you enjoyed yourselves. Yeah.